guys, my name is Greg. I'm gonna come back at you uh, this time with a little supplement uh, review. This is my supplement stack. As you can see, all of them are from Optimum Nutrition ON. Every single one of these. Um, and what I'm gonna tell you about today is just like about each each one of these and like you know what they do and stuff like that. Uh, so you guys can get insight of what you're looking for as far as what your goals are concerned with. Um, so what we're gonna start with is. Protein. Now, there's so many different types of protein that out there. You have uh, casein, or some people call it cassian, um, and you have your whey. Uh, there's three types of uh, protein segments, I guess you could say. There's concentrate, there's isolates, and then there's hydrolyzed peptides. What this is, that's what this stuff is. Um, <clears throat> concentrate is about 60% protein. The, ru the rest is, it comes from milk. Uh, the rest is all the cholesterols, all the fats, and I believe that there's one other thing in there. Or maybe it's just fat and cholesterol. Um, but yeah, it's 60% of the weight is protein, and that's in the concentrate. Uh, now for isolates, um, isolates are a more pure form of protein. They have about 70 to 80-ish percent uh, protein by weight, and the rest is just filtered down more. And what hydrolyzed protein, that's what this stuff is, I'll get to this stuff in a bit, minute, um, that's the purest form of protein out there. Uh, basically it just mixes really well, it dissolves, or it doesn't dissolve, it um, digests really quick so you get into the bloodstream faster for a quicker recovery. And um, this is my baby, hydrolyzed, this is my baby, I love it. Uh, we'll get to that in a bit though, but uh, what uh, casing is, casing is a slow releasing protein. Um, I take this right before I go to bed uh, because the whole point, the whole goal of trying to build muscle is to stay in an anabolic state. Uh, catabolic is the opposite of that. Catabolic meaning you're breaking down muscle. Anabolic is just the opposite. Um, and you need to stay anabolic for as long as you can. Uh, you're in catabolic state obviously when you're lifting and also um, when you fall asleep when you go to bed because you're not getting any nutrients. What this does, it digests really slowly in your stomach so you have a constant flow of amino acids and that helps with um, keeping your body in an anabolic state and helping you recover more even while you're sleeping. And that's what this does. Or if you need if you need to like, you're on the go and you can't get a meal in, just you know, take a serving of this. It's really thick um, and it dissolves really slow and you'll be set for a couple hours. Um, next <coughs> is their Optimum Nutrition's Gold Standard Whey. Now if I was to recommend any protein out there, it'd be this bad boy. Because this is really expensive and it's a little more advanced. But this is an all around good protein. Uh, this is made from uh, whey isolates. Yep, whey isolates, the primary source. Again, it's about 70 to 80 percent protein by weight uh, per gram. Uh, this stuff I take in the morning, right when I wake up. This is, I believe, cinnamon graham cracker. It kind of sounds, kind of sounds a little weird, but uh, it actually tastes insanely good. It tastes like uh, like a cold cappuccino. I don't know if you guys like coffee or like cappuccinos, but it tastes like a cold cappuccino pretty much. This stuff, this uh, this casing was Chocolate Supreme. I wasn't too impressed with Chocolate Supreme. I'm taking chocolate cake batter for the for casing right now and it tastes, it tastes orgasmic. It tastes amazing. Uh, but uh, cinnamon graham cracker I actually like, but it's all personal preference. Um, but this is all around good protein. Uh, each, each of these have their the BCAAs and their amino acids. This has a really, really solid uh, uh, count for each amino acid. So they have 11 grams of your essentials, 7.7 .7 grams of your conditionally essentials, and 5.3 of your non-essentials. Um, so this is really good. I take this, again, right when I wake up to fuel my body to get the jump start on the day. And But this is an all-around good protein. This is the bad boy I'd recommend overall. Now, my baby, Hydroway, love it, absolutely love it. Uh, the essential amino acid content in this is 11 grams, this is 15.5, and this also has 38 servings right here, it normally has from 38 to 40. Uh, this has 48 servings for 
3.3 uh, pound jug, and this bad boy is 55 servings. Um, but this is the biggest they come in, 38 to 40 servings. Hydra Way is it's it's amazing. It's simply amazing. I've seen I've seen gains on it for the next for the first month I was on it, and it's just I can't preach to you guys enough how good this shit is. Uh, but the only downside, it's really expensive. Like it's like at GNC, it's like 110 bucks for this thing. It's really expensive, but it's worth it if you know how to use it. If your diet's in check and you're training right and you use this stuff, it it will be worth your money. Um, but Again, all of this is just based off what your goals are. I am a little, I'm trying to get higher up there in the industry, so I'm going to take the best products there are. I just I love Optimum Nutrition. Uh, now, this <clears throat> this is their multivitamin. It actually extends out like that, and they come in packs. It's about seven different things you take in each pack. There's about 30 of these packs per box. Uh, this is, this is... Um, one of the things that I would strongly recommend you get in your stack, regardless of your goals, just because it builds the foundation for a healthy and fit body and a physique. Um, there's 59 different acting ingredients in this, in each, or in total in the seven pills or capsules or whatever that you take. Uh, basically, it has a high potency vitamin, um, multi-mineral tablet, a vitamin D soft gel, Joint support complex capsule, uh, digestive enzymes, which is crucial, uh, kerosene beta alanine to give you a little bit of a pump throughout your day. You're not going to really notice it that much, but it dilates your muscle, your muscle fibers, and your blood vessels, so more blood flows through it. That's why you get the pump, uh, so more nutrients go into your muscles throughout the whole day. Uh, but it's not that much. It's not as much as like a pre workout would be. But uh, it has that, and then it also has a uh, muscle pump capsule too, which is pretty much consists of L-citrulline, which is a precursor to nitric oxide. But I'll get into that stuff later. Um, but <clears throat> I strongly recommend this stuff, uh, regardless of what your goals are. Um, vitamins are really crucial. I mean, joint support, especially if you're lifting heavy weight, if you're trying to build mass, and you're lifting all these heavy poundages, you need something like a joint complex capsule to help support your joints. You know, that's just one thing, you know, but it's 59 active ingredients in this thing, 30 servings, or 30 packets, I should say, and it's really convenient. You just open it up, pop one. Uh, I take it in the morning, obviously, but I take it with food, because if you take it with an empty stomach, you're going to get an upset stomach, so um, strongly, strongly, strongly recommend this. This was about, I want to say 36 bucks around there, around 40 bucks, but it's worth it. It's worth it. Um, this is, now lastly, is Amino Energy. Uh, this can be considered a pre-workout. Uh, I don't really call it a pre-workout. Um, even if like you're a mom or a dad and you just need you know, something to boost you throughout the day, this will do it. It has uh, only caffeine and your essential amino acids. It has five grams of your essential amino acids per serving. And there's two servings, or two scoops for a serving. 30 servings in each one of these. Uh, this is watermelon. I actually have actually have watermelon and uh, blueberry, but because I, I heard watermelon was the best tasting, but I always had a thing for blueberry. Um, but that's just me. Uh, I, have, I personally feel blueberry tastes better than watermelon, but you know, it's it's whatever you prefer. But basically, this is just like a it can be a pre workout, an AM wake up, uh, post workout. Uh, drink along with your protein, obviously, or just an afternoon pick me up. You know, it gives it gives the servings. Um, I don't know if you can see, but it gives up this amount of scoops you should take for each. Um, and for a pick me up, it's two to four. Um, I'm not that sensitive to caffeine, so I need to take a little bit more to kind of feel the effects of it. But if you're someone that's sensitive to caffeine, um, there's 160 milligrams of it. In every two scoops, and your daily your daily intake should max out at um, I think it's around 400 milligrams or so a day. If you were to uh, taking caffeine, that's how much you should limit yourself to. So, but that's uh, that's me. Like, not everyone's gonna be like that. Obviously, I'm just not that caffeine sensitive. 
Um, but this stuff tastes amazing. I take it um, on the heavy days, like light days, sometimes back. Depends if I'm deadlifting or not. Um, but basically, uh, this is just something to keep you going throughout your day. You'll get, you won't feel jittery. You won't feel like, you know, like super bad. But it'll help you stay awake, keep you focused, and get you throughout your day. So, that's pretty much everything I take from Optimum Nutrition. I'm not sponsored by them. I'm hoping to be, just because I absolutely love their products and I see results with these products. Um, but, you know, again, to recap the whole thing, this is, this is number one. Go out, and, I would definitely go out and get this. This stuff is crucial for you. That's just to help, again, build a foundation to help you support uh, everything in your body later on. Now, for the proteins, it depends on your goals. It also depends on your financial situation. If you're, if money isn't a problem, go with the Hydroway. If some people, um, some people actually take Hydroway in the morning and then take it after they work out too, because they just love it that much. I just take um, this before or right before, or right after I wake up. Excuse me, and then this right after, and then this before bed. Um, but Generally, you want to have a whey protein, a fast digestion protein, and a, a casein protein. Um, but that's that's up to you. You can choose it, choose to buy those or not. Um, another slow digesting protein source is, you know, things like your your chickens, your egg whites, kind of cheese stuff like that. If you eat that before you go to bed, you'll be fine too. But, but basically, this is just a supplement your diet, and just it's more convenient. But um, yeah, so that's just what I take. Um, hope you guys learned a little bit about my stack here. There will be a lot more videos to come uh, on RipTraining.com. But until then, peace.